this is a vendor caps glitch uh, infinite caps video um, where I will show you guys how you can get basically infinite caps or so the way that you will never run out of caps um, so this can be done with any vendor um, this video will do it with Flack and Rivet City um, you start out the glitch mainly by just talking to them and when you're talking to him, the way this glitch is performed is when you see an item such as combat armor or any item basically that they have two of, you can buy one of them and buy it, resell it, and just keep doing that. It should take two or three tries, and then all of a sudden when you buy it, it'll be at full damage resistance, or uh, full condition, sorry. And what you can do is you can keep buying and sell it back for a cap gain. And this way, you can basically buy out the vendor totally. And then you can just keep repeating the process by waiting uh, 72 hours. Um, if you over... If, um, this is best if you kind of don't have a lot of caps. Um, like if you only have like around a thousand like this character does. It can, wor it can work really well um, for buying a bunch of ammo if you need anything or something like that. Um, so here I just keep buying back all the combat armor. And uh, I find it best just to clear out all their ammo. And then do this glitch, obviously. And so here I'm just buying everything that I can. And then whenever I need more caps back from all the stuff that I'm buying... I just keep repeating the glitch, and it's just as simple as that. Um, this um, this glitch, I probably should say, um, works on the PC, the Xbox 360, and the PS3. This is filmed on the Xbox 360 version with uh, the latest patch. Um, I think it's like 5 or 1.5 or 1.4 or something like that. Um, but anyway, you can just keep buying and selling back but uh, make sure when you're buying buying uh, when you're buying the armor the first time um, or the first few times make sure you're buying the same one um, to get the I to get the glitch working otherwise it uh, might or might not work and what you don't want to do is you don't want to run out of cap so you can't afford to buy the combat armor um, otherwise you couldn't start doing the glitch up again. And then you'd run into a few problems, so just don't even bother. Uh, or don't get your caps too low. So anyway, I just keep on repeating it here. I think I'll fast forward. And there we go. I'm just going to buy him all the way out. And just make sure that you don't that he uh, doesn't have anything else that you'd like. Yep, sir. And what you're going to do now is you're going to wait 40 or 72 hours. Um, you just do it in three 24-hour periods. And what this will do is it'll cause the vendor to restock themselves with ammo and caps and all that stuff. Um, so it's very easy to continuously do this if you have like maybe say an hour, maybe not even an hour. Maybe if you just want to spend like five or ten minutes and get a bunch of caps and stuff and ammo and you don't want to have to really worry about being real conservative of your ammo this is a great way um, I just waited an hour to get a vendor back in here so basically the rest of this video is just me doing it again there's uh, all his ammo back um, now see he didn't have another set of combat armor this time um, but I went to his weapons and I did it with a Chinese assault rifle uh, anything will work the thing you want to look out for is stuff that will be worth the most when sold back at full condition and you also want to make sure that you're buying whatever item at a very low price preferably the lower the condition of the item the more money or how f the faster the glitch will basically end up going um, so that's about it here um, I show the last I will show the rest of this run I'll fast forward it as well and that's the glitch. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed and subscribe if you liked it.
ました。